ऐसी म्यूचुअल एजेंट आए यमयू पीएचएल ऐसी म्यूचुअल क्वांटम नंबर डिनोटेड बाय स्मॉल लेटर एल द फर्स्ट पॉइंट शिप of the electron cloud second one sub एनर्जी लेवल इन मेन सेल थर्ड वन डिनोटेड बाय एल फोर्थ वन ऑर्बिटल क्वांटम नंबर फिफ्थ सब सेल्स एस पी डी एंड एफ सिक्स वन एस वैल्यूज वैल्यूज एन माइनस वन दैट इज जीरो वन टू थ्री सिक्स वन एस टू पी सिक्स डी टेन एफ फोर्टीन सेवन S P D F sharp principle diffuse W W and the last one that is fundamental fundamental. So this is a second quantum number that is called azimuthal quantum number, and this azimuthal quantum number is also called orbital quantum number. And the reason of orbital quantum number, why it is called orbital quantum number, it can be discussed below in the fourth point. So we mention. previous previously that is in case of characteristics of principal quantum number as principal quantum number gives the size of the electron cloud and principal quantum number gives number of main energy levels present in the atom of an element so same two parallel points regarding this azimuthal quantum number as we mentioned before that is azimuthal quantum number gives the most correct more correct position as compared to 
principal quantum number. This azimuthal quantum number gives the shape of the electron cloud. So this shape of the electron cloud explains the dimensions, length and width of the shape of the orbital. So shape of the shape of electron cloud that is azimuthal quantum number gives the shape of the orbitals that is the s orbital has a shape spherical or a p orb and p orbital is dumbbell in shape or s orbital has a spherical shape while p orbital has a dumbbell shape d orbital has a complicated and f orbital has a more complicated structure it is not given here only only s orbital is a spherical in shape and p orbital is dumbbell in shaped dumbbell shaped it means that azimuthal quantum number gives a shape of the electron cloud in case of principal quantum number principal quantum number gives the size of the electron cloud so size of the electron cloud is the character of principal while shape of the electron cloud is the character of azimuthal quantum number that is shape of the s orbital is spherical in nature and shape of the p orbital is dumbbell shaped in nature this is the first point regarding azimuthal quantum number as we mentioned in the principal quantum number that is principal quantum number principal quantum number gives number of main energy level pr levels present in the atom of an element at the same time as we mentioned that is this gives a more correct position of an electron and that's why this uh, azimuthal quantum number gives the number of sub energy level or the number of sub shells present in the main energy level this is the most classic point regarding this azimuthal quantum number that is main main energy levels are explained by principal at the same time sub energy levels are in main energy level so position in the main energy level is nothing but the sub energy level hence this is the more correct position of an electron which is present in the main energy level and given by azimuthal quantum number so azimuthal quantum number gives number of sub energy levels present in the main energy level or main shell this is the second point it is denoted by small letter l principal quantum number is denoted by a small letter n at the same time this azimuthal quantum number is denoted by a small letter l this quantum number gives shape of the orbitals that is s spherical and p dumbbell shaped hence this is called the quantum number which gives orbit shape of the orbitals and it is hence it is called orbital quantum number so the first point shape of the electron cloud this is the first one give it gives number of sub energy levels in the main energy level it is denoted by small letter l and this azimuthal quantum number is also called orbital quantum number because it explains the shape of the orbitals like s and p that is spherical and dumbbell shaped in nature fifth point is that the sub energy levels or sub shells are denoted by small letters because principal quantum number gives number of main energy levels present in the atom of an element this quantum number gives a number of sub shells or a number of sub energy levels present in the main energy level as these are sub energy levels or sub shells hence denoted by obviously small letters that is s p d and f why this s p d and f letters are chosen for to represent this sub energy levels it has some meaningful reasons that is s means s letter is taken from the <coughs> word sharp so the elements which are placed in the predictable left hand side of the predictable 
the elements are the elements which belongs to two vertical columns of the left hand side of the periodic table or in general the elements which are placed extreme left especially two columns two first two columns are called s block elements because these elements are very sharp in nature they are capable given they take a part in a chemical reaction as quickly as possible this sharpness this activity explains its sharpness and that's why s is uh, taken from the word sharp hence these are called s block element so the first main energy level is denoted by s second one that is principal p sub energy level second sub energy level is called p so p means these elements are placed extreme right hand side of the periodic table extreme right right hand side this is the left side of the periodic table called s block this is the left right hand side of the periodic table and that's why these elements are called p block elements that is p why this p is taken this p later is taken it is taken from the word principal so the principal that is p p is taken because these elements are generally take part in a chemical reaction or behaves as a principal that is for example we can say that aluminum <coughs> aluminum is the 13th element in the periodic table and place the right hand side of the periodic table its electronic configuration ends with p so this aluminum why it is called a p block element or it behaves as a person like principal so this p aluminum conducts electricity as quickly as possible you know aluminum is the best conductor or the cheapest conductor of heat and electricity this is one of the principle of element like aluminum and that's why the elements which are placed extreme right are called p block elements and that's why pr from principle the letter p is taken diffuse d stands for diffuse the elements which are placed at the center of the periodic table the elements which are placed at the center or the elements which are placed at the middle part or the elements which are placed in between s block and p block elements are called diffuse or d block elements hence diffusion means scattering hence this d letter is taken from the word diffuse the last one that is fundamental some of the elements or majority of the elements which are placed at the bottom of the periodic table and these elements are fundamental naturally occur major majority of the elements are naturally occurring and that's why these elements are called fundamental elements and in the periodic table such type of elements fundamental elements are placed at the bottom of the periodic table so this is all about azimuthal quantum number the values of azimuthal quantum number the last point regarding this azimuthal quantum number is that the values of azimuthal quantum number lies in between 0 to 3 0 to 3